E aí, pessoal, beleza? Tudo bem? Aqui quem fala é Evergame. O jogo de hoje é Stories The Page The Office Destinies. Sim, um jogo ganhado na... no jogo da TSN, agora do jogo de dezembro. E veio de graça pra gente, né? Vamos estar conferindo. Eu não estarei jogando, estará jogando meu guri, meu piá. Vamos estar conferindo o jogo. Mas eu vou estar continuando o jogo ali, que o começo dele é muito devagar, muito lento. Então é bom nós começar um pouco avançado, não ele vai demorar muito. O slow do jogo pode ver meio pesado. Kid was looking down, watching his city burn. Sorry, kid. Renato told the kid. Look, if we give them the book, they'll leave you alone. My mother died for this book! I promised her I'd protect you. Oh, damn it. The kid had run off. With the book, of course. So Renato. O jogo ele tá em inglês. O áudio, mas. Tá com legendas em português. Isso é muito bom, isso é legal. Proteja Peter. The two ravens were staring at the kid like he was their dinner, which probably was what was in their tiny brains. Hey, Renato said. They cocked their heads at him. Pick on someone as ugly as you. Wait, that didn't come out right. For the Emperor! The ravens cawed and rushed at him. Legal. Revisar o ataque. Eles foram bem fraquinha, bem tranquilo de passar por eles. A dropship flew overhead. He hoped they hadn't noticed him. Oh right, the gate of heroes. Someone's idea of a joke, making the Skyship docks a gated community. You needed a hero's sword to open it, and the kid was on the other side of the gate. Who let you through? Promise me you'll take the book to the rebels, or I'm going to steal your ship. I'm not taking the damn book anywhere, and neither are you. Try and stop me. Laughed the kid. I bet you don't even have a hero sword. And with that, the kid hopped away. Had to hand it to the kid. He was an idiot, but he had guts. Where was Renata going to get a hero sword? Or and wind essence? That sounds about perfect. Criação de espadas são menos do criação de espadas. Aqui você pode criar, atualizar espadas. Mágicas poderosas. Colete materiais necessários do baú espalhado por Boreas. Uhum. Uma atualizada na nossa espada, ela ficou mais forte agora. QED. This is what he got for settling down and finding people to care about. The kid's mum had been a swell cook and she'd laughed at Renato's jokes, even when he didn't know he'd made one. And then the ravens had come to burn her. And she'd made him promise to protect the kid. But she never told him where the book was, just the kid. 
He came up to a ledge. It was too far to jump. There'd been a bridge here before, hadn't there? And there was Peter, giggling at him. How'd you get across? He asked the kid. Where'd you find a hook? I harped, said the kid. Wise ass kid. Hey, look out behind you! Os gráficos do jogo até que estão legal, não tão tão ruim. Ah, Ravens. Claro que eu pensei que seria um outro jogo mais legais agora no final do ano, né? It was time to put some sense into the kid. Just hook his way across the ledge and chase the kid down. Thing was. Use o altar para adquirir novas habilidades. Maybe if he meditated at that altar there, he'd remember his old skills. Então, os níveis, pontos de habilidade tem um disponível. Vamos usar ali o gancho. It was starting to come back to him. Something you never completely forgot. Like how to freeze time. Agora foi legal, hein? Queria saber como que aquele outro piazinho tá fazendo tudo isso sem o gancho. Ou ele tem gancho. And there was the Farfarer. She was the fastest ship he'd ever known. She could do the Kessel run in 12 furlongs. So the salesman told him. And something told him the kid was about to walk into an ambush. Stop! He shouted. I'm not giving you the book! Shouted the kid and took off. No! Peter! But the kid ran for it. And a goggler nailed him with its eye. Ish. The book was unburned. Next to it were the buckles from the kid's shoes and the kid-sized pile of ashes. Damn it! Why hadn't he lied and told the kid he'd take the book to the rebels? The kid would be alive now. Really pissed off and betrayed, but Caramba, man. Já virou cinza. Damn it! Renato picked up the book. He couldn't let the Empire have it now. He was going to have to get it out of there. He'd be a wanted man. Probably have to join the rebellion just to have a place to dock. Well, he'd hated home life anyway. What was the big deal about this book anyway? Maybe he should open it and find out. Coitado do guri. All that had been years ago. Troféu conquistado, novo leitor. Three Raven scout ships were chasing him. Where are you running, rebel? Cored the Raven captain over the loud hailer. Renato could see them cranking up their catapults. Just going out for milk? Renato yelled back. Where can you run? Laughed the Raven horribly. Far behind him, another city was burning. The dark cloud above its island was thousands of Imperial ships. The fleet was doing a thorough job. Take us to the rebel base, and we'll spare your life! It called. The entire jury-rigged rebel fleet was only a few islands to the east. Beyond that were only the pillars of heaven, a sea of endless blood-colored tornadoes. The rebellion was out of time. Unless Renardo could bring a game-changer. Maybe he could. Renardo had found out where he could find the pieces of the Sky Ripper, the legendary weapon that had exiled the lost gods. Surely a legendary weapon could win the final battle. On the other hand, his old friend Lupino had sent Renardo a desperate message saying he had a brilliant scheme to save the rebellion. If Renardo could only rescue him, Renardo dived the farfarer towards the abyss as he felt the heat of the jet stream. The Raven ships peeled off, not stable enough to follow him down there. Now it was time to choose. Lapino or the Sky Ripper.
Every child knew about the Sky Ripper. The Transcendent Emperor had buried its pieces. What could have brought them to light? This Emperor, Isengrim III, had once been kind, but he'd gone mad. And now he was conducting secret, obscene rituals to bring back the lost gods. Had he, somehow, summoned the long-lost components of the legendary weapon out of the deep places of the Earth? It was more than Renardo could fathom. But if he could find a legendary weapon, he would use it. As he set foot in the island, Renardo could not help but feel a tinge of guilt. He'd left Lapino behind. He hoped the mad rabbit had somehow então, escaped the raid. Noite, aqui, na ilha, he hoped they had eaten him. If they had, he hoped they had eaten him alive. Why had he chosen the Sky Ripper? Renardo never made plans that required constant a vigilance. Do cima, he was a hero. He didn't think too much. Aqui, he just went with his gut and hoped it all worked out. The Sky Ripper was a long shot. He'd have to devote Sim. himself to it. No side journeys, no rescuing old friends. That was against his nature. É, o primeiro e sem ser defendido. Segundo, com o quadrado, com o bolso. Deixa eu só pegar a armadura de Scarlet. Vou andar pra cá. Mais um baúzinho. Pegamos mais minério. Podemos fazer joias ou a espada. Joias é magia, né? It's gonna be really short. Só que nós temos. Ver se a gente vai conseguir fazer alguma magia. Não temos nenhuma joia. No Brasil, não deu para fazer nada. Será que dá para bater atrás nesses bichinhos? Bicho aí. Essa foi por pouco. Tem dois ali agora. Hum? Hum, tá? Isso foi novo. Muitas pessoas usam os doorknobs. Está naquele outro lado aí. Se outro carinha fica ali, cara. Só que não. Vi atingido. The people who had built this castle. Did they even know what monstrous weapon lay hidden within their walls? The Sky River could destroy anything it touched. Or so the legend said. As the transcendent emperor had fought the lost gods, thousands of thousands had died. But Renato had been through wars. The only merciful war was a short one. Hmm. Hero wall. Hero sword. Ice wall. Ice. Cube. This is for. Eita porcaria, achei que ia brincar no tom aí. Talvez seja. Não é 
Renata felt ready to take on you. Acho que dá pra wasn't so hard. Bridges, anyway. It was starting to come back to him. Something you never completely forgot, like how to freeze time when attacking. The more he fought, the more he'd probably remember. There it was. Skyripper's armature. The stuff that dreams are made of. Engineer's dreams, anyway. The device was intricate. No one alive had the skill to make a thing like it. How is it part of a weapon at all? He'd have to ask a scientist. But first, he'd get the second piece. Sky Ripper had a heart, a core that had come to rest on the next island. Well, there was another island he could reach. Zenobia had just invaded it with her father's raven battalions. She must be encamped there still. But fighting Zenobia now, that made no sense at all. He'd already sacrificed one friend to get this, this armature, was it? He didn't need to hurry to face her. She would find him. It 
was a no-brainer. He'd sacrificed his old friend Lapino to get the armature. And the armature was useless by itself, only a series of coils and wheels. War demanded sacrifices, and he would make more before the end. He would have to choose the greatest good, no matter how much it cost him. Zenobia. Well, he would see her sooner or later, across a battlefield or a sword's point before all this was over. He was sure of that. The power was in the core. Obviously, he had to get the core. Bom pessoal, com isso eu vou encerrando essa gameplay. Espero que vocês tenham gostado e curtido. Foi bem bacana, deu 20 minutos, foi bem legal. E é isso aí. Se inscreva no canal, dê seu joinha, compartilhe, favorite e assine o sininho aí embaixo para receber notificações do canal quando chegar coisas novas, novos vídeos você está recebendo. Agradeço a todos. Doubt Falou. sunk in before Tchau. he was even out of sight of the Farfarer. Why had he chosen the Sky River? It was a sort of...